For many, a serious physical illness can trigger depression and suicidal thoughts. I'm sick today. But for actress Selma Blair, who was diagnosed with multiple sclerosis in 2018, the opposite occurred. I really had been suicidal, like, my whole life. But the biggest transformation of this with the diagnosis, it took away these suicidal tendencies. Like, I want to live. Blair, now 49, came of age in films like Cruel Intentions, co-starring Sarah Michelle Gellar, and Legally Blonde, opposite Reese Witherspoon. You know how you called me maudlin before? You ain't seen nothing yet. But she is on screen now to share her journey with MS an incurable and debilitating neurological condition in the new documentary, Introducing Selma Blair, which follows her as she undergoes stem cell treatment. I was told to make plans for dying, not because I have MS, because I'm fighting MS. The film shows Blair at her rawest, depleted by chemotherapy and overcome by lethargy, a symptom of MS. I can't breathe because I can't breathe. Director Rachel Flight has said she and Blair connected immediately due to both of them having an autoimmune disease. Flight's is alopecia, which causes hair loss. Shooting was understandably difficult during Blair's treatments. I was very much aware that my subject also was not feeling well, you know, and so we didn't, we wouldn't do like 12 hour days. We would get these like short chunks of time together. So we do like and maybe I go back to bed. Blair's advice to those with MS, listen to your body. Don't just say, oh, it's not happening, but you know, have patience. This took a while to kind of build this nervous system in you. Try not to worry. This is your body giving you a gift, sadly, of telling you, slow down. Introducing Selma Blair is currently in select theaters and streaming on Discovery+.